Lennon McCartney were sensational, but so was Bacharach and David. They were phenomenal. And the key is having that ability to still keep coming up with it. And both Lennon and McCartney had it. And I often wonder, um, McCartney writes phenomenal songs. He's probably the richest songwriter of them all. I don't know about Elton or whatever, but he's phenomenal talent. But I often wonder what they used to have, Lennon and McCartney, is what Bill and Phil had, myself and Phil. We, we could edit each other. You know, Phil could write something and I would say, that's a lot of rubbish. Why don't we change it? For example, when he wrote, I think I love you. And uh, he left it on the manuscript on the piano. And uh, we went to the publisher at that time. And he said, I'm sure you've got something better in you. After we'd done a song called My Magic Music Box, you've never heard of it. So he wrote, I think I love you. So I wrote rubbish across it. And the next day he came and he says, well, help it. I says, well, it's five syllables. Why don't we call it congratulations and celebrations? And that's teamwork. And that's editing. And it was the same when we made records. Phil would sit for hours, which I can't do, listening to some group, perfecting this or doing that. And I would come in and just say, that's rubbish, it's too slow. And that's the trick. And the difference was that Lennon and McCartney were like that. They never wrote a song together since I saw her standing there. It was a competition. Lennon would write a song, and then McCartney would write a song. And it was just that phenomenal competition they had. And I'd love to have known what would have happened 